My name is Thelma Sue Henley, and I'm a rancher. I basically learned how to run a ranch uh, just from observing and being around my dad and uh, my great aunt because they've been ranchers all my life. The majority of people that live around here would say nobody knew cattle better than Bill Henley. My brand is T-Bar Cross. It's the same brand that my great aunt and uncle had. This place has been in the family for a couple hundred years. The house is almost uh, 100 years old. I just always loved it down here. Overall, I've probably been in the cattle business around 28 years from the time that I grew up. Here at Henley Ranch is I uh, have a cow-calf operation. There are buyers that come from all over the United States to the sale barn where I ship, where I take my cattle. So it's mainly beef cattle for people to eat. The main responsibility is you want to have uh, the best cattle that you can have. Most of my calves will dress, uh, are called number ones. They will dress out as choice calves. You've got to make sure that the cattle always have enough grass, enough hay. They're fed the right amount. They have the right amount of minerals or salt. I want to deliver the best product that, uh, the best product that I can and that would be the number one calves for a market. I used to break and train horses. In fact, I was breaking and training horses by the time I was around 12 years old. I was told that I was literally riding before I could walk. I don't even remember the first horse I was on. I just always remember being on a horse. <laughs> it was natural to me and I used to love it when people would say, oh, that scrawny little girl, she, she couldn't ride that horse. And I would get out there and ride them and it was too rough for, for other people to ride. <laughs> when I was 16, I was on Good Morning America. I was selected because it just was almost unheard of for women to do uh, the work with horses that, that I did. I was training race horses before women were allowed on the track. And some of them went on to be the world's champion. As a person, I just uh, feel that it's very important to keep your word to people and do the best you can do. I try to uh, deliver quality products and help people when I can. I'm hoping to be able to expand the ranch by uh, clearing more property and being able to buy more cattle and uh, raising more calves. And I'm hoping that as I get a little larger that I will have a bigger clientele because I, I do prefer to be known that I raise good cattle. The main advice that I could tell people that want to get in the cattle business is you have to have a lot of determination and be a strong-willed person because it's, it's not an easy life. You have to really like what you're doing and be determined. My dad, uh, Wilburn M. Bill Henley, they always called him Big Bill, uh, would be my main mentor. Actually for my life, for cattle business or horses or just the kind of person he was. Some of the clients that I have uh, have been clients for 20, 30, 40, 50 years. They were clients of my dad's and then they're uh, my clients. And we've just always been known to raise quality cattle and I keep trying to improve on that. I admire her uh, get up and go and her uh, dedication to keeping this ranch operation going. And, uh, and she loves the cattle, she loves the horses, and she loves this land. And I'm, uh, I'm proud of her for that. I'm hoping that I'm able to turn this place back into the show place and the beautiful place that it once was. I mean, it's beautiful now, but uh, before it was just, people would drive for miles to come down here just to see the place. Okay. And I would like to turn it into that again. The main reward I've seen over the years is being able to just drive down the road and even come in home I can tell that it's already looking like it used to, a lot like it used to look.
I mean, it, the, the ranch does. It was, everything had been let go, and now it's, it's getting, uh, it's rewarding to see the results of some of my efforts. I just want the, the world to see the ranch as I want to see it, that it's a lot of, it has entailed a lot of hard work and the uh, result is, is very clear.